Life is pretty simple when you think about it. People live, people die. These are two choices people make daily. It comes down to a simple choice. Get busy living or get busy dying. People go through life, but the constant choice to live or die is a continuous idea in the back of the head of everyone. Some people want to live, but are held back by the beliefs of what living should actually be like. In a perfect day for Banana Fish, Seymour is held back by what he believes is how people should live their lives with purity and innocence. But this belief is taken away from him in the form of Sybil, who he believed to be one of the pure individuals Seymour has met in his life, only to be crushed and to realize she has been corrupted by society and leads to his suicide. Death is a barrier to many people, but death can open new beginnings. In Seven Pounds, our main character, Ben Thomas, attempts to make up for his killing of seven innocent people for the improvement of seven other people's lives who he believes are important. He does this by giving up his own body. Getting busy dying is a morbid way to put this, I guess. Yet, guessing, getting busy dying for a cause is another way to show growth for an attempt to create change. Learning before death, whether it be the individual passing or those surrounding of the individual, it is a blessing. Consider Jefferson from a lesson before dying. A blessing, a blessing is the realistic look on his life. Having been held back by society's rules and standards, Jefferson was thrown in jail, only to be called an animal. Jefferson, before wasting away like those who called him an animal, more specifically a hog, said he would, turns his experience of dying into a lesson for those surrounding him. And those who see his past learn how he changes in his life to improve, with the help of Grant's guidance, of course. For these people, they have some, something in common. They want something from the world. They, want, they all want to be remembered as the common trend between them all. Seymour wants to, people to recognize how he suffered, how the world has taken away the purity. Ben wants to be remembered as a redeemed individual who saved lives rather than taking them. Jefferson wants his community to remember him as the man who died to an unjust cause due to segregation in his community. What I know for sure is that people want to go through life whether they be living it or dying in it. People want to make a connection. Whether this connection be with many people or few, connections are what make people happy. As more shorts taught, connections are what keep people going. Whether it be the remembrance of a friend that keeps you going, learning from others when it is important to hold on, or when it is important to look out. Connections keep people together and moving forward together. Thank you for listening.